alias is Calamity. And um, the way I came up with that was I basically uh, I wanted something that I thought represented me and my type of uh, play style. So I just, you know, kind of went through a dictionary and looked up a, different, a bunch of different words. And I came across uh, Calamity, which is um, I'm paraphrasing here. It's like a great disaster or great misfortune. Um, and I kind of feel like that's what I bring to my enemies because I like to play a lot of PvP uh, type of type of games. I'm a real competitive person, so I like to say that I like to bring calamity to my uh, opposition. I've been a content creator on Twitch. Coming up on uh, August this year will be four years, actually. The type of content I usually stream on Twitch. Uh, usually I play a lot of shooters, uh, first person, third person, and battle royales. So lately I've been playing a lot of uh, Call of Duty, especially Warzone. I also play games like uh, Darwin Project, uh, Realm Royale, and Overwatch. Wow, that's a good question. My most proudest moment in my stream career has actually been a good bit. I've been uh, I've been pretty blessed so far. I'd like to say my the short. I feel like it's a short time that I've been on Twitch. Um, I I think it was at 2018. I was actually uh, accepted to the Twitch hosting and interviewing workshop. So I was actually flown out to uh, San Francisco for a couple of days and actually hosted Twitch Weekly along with, uh, you know, DJ Wheat and Anna Prosser and, and a bunch of other great content creators. Um, I've also been blessed to be on front page uh, coming up on like, I think, five times now and I'm approaching one million uh, channel views. So, um, yeah, it's kind of hard to pick one. But um, and I'll say I worked with Twitch last Twitch, this past TwitchCon um, as a on air talent for them for a segment they called in case you missed it. So. Um, yeah, it's kind of hard. I guess the first, I guess the the biggest one would be the uh, the accept, acceptance to the uh, hosting and interviewing workshop and being flown out to uh, Twitch headquarters. Cause I think that was kind of like the uh, the beginning of everything that has come since then. Um, the thing I really like about Call of Duty and it, it keeps me coming back to it. I just I like how they keep trying to innovate and get better. You know, of course, there's there's a new one like every year. They have multiple devs working on it, so there's always changes, and some are better than others. We all know. Um, but I just like how Let's they go. just keep right. trying to improve and I like how it's, you know, a fast paced uh, game style and I definitely like Warzone. I like the different takes that they've done with Warzone. I like the additions to Warzone that you really haven't seen. I feel in prior BRs, especially things like the Gulag and stuff like that. I think that's a very cool aspect um, of the game and uh, just the ability to to play with your friends yeah, on a massive world like that and just having the ability to get your own loadout too, which is something new for BRs. Oh you usually God. just have to, Yo, you know, get right vehicles or, or get weapons that are just dropped on the zone or whatnot. So the, the, the ability to have your own custom loadout in type of a BR, I think is something that's really new and cool that's really drawn me to it. What I do outside of gaming is um, my oh professional my background is actually working in radio. Oh so I've been working in the broadcasting field since like 2008. So I guess, you know, and I've always, of course, been a gamer most of my life, like a lot of the people that are watching this video and a lot of people that are members of uh, Nemesis. Um, so I feel like my broadcasting experience plus my gaming passion uh, has kind of been a perfect marriage for streaming in general because, you know, streaming is uh, it's media just like television, oh, just like radio and movies. So since I already had that professional background, that's like uh, kind of helped my streaming career. So I do radio um, outside of work. I'm an on-air talent. Um, I've done traffic reporting. Uh, I've been an on-air jock. Uh, more so, I'm, I'm behind the scenes now. I'm doing more of a, a producer, board operator. I also do uh, acting out of uh, outside of streaming and outside of radio. And I do uh, esports and gaming, hosting and uh, content creation and commentating. I am Calamity. We are your nemesis.